Hello, 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 everyone. Thank you so much for tuning in. Today's YouTube video is going to be on an actual video of an interview of me asking questions and the interviewer answering them the wrong or the right way, the wrong and the right way. So I hope you guys enjoy this. This is supposed to be entertaining. It's supposed to be fun. It's supposed to allow you guys to see different perspectives of interviews. Interviews from someone doing it the wrong way. Interviews from doing from someone doing it the right way. My husband is actually going to be the one who's actually be the one that's actually the interviewee, and I'm the interviewer. So please take tips. Please listen up because you always want to make sure that your interview is is on point to make sure that you actually get that job that you so want. All right. I hope you guys enjoy it. Please subscribe to my channel. Please like, unlike if you don't like, and what comments are welcome as well. All right. I'll see you guys on the next YouTube video. Please enjoy the skit. Love you guys. All right. Bye. Hi, Mr. Thompson. Thank you so much for coming in today. My name is Jessamine, and I'll be doing the interview with you. All right. And and um, today we'll just ask you a few questions to see if you're a good fit for the position, and then we'll decide if you actually are qualified for the position. Right, cool. My first question is, uh, well, can you tell me a little bit about yourself and why you want this job? Uh, you know, I, I felt I needed some more income, some more money, so I figured I'd apply for the job. That's oh. pretty much. Okay. Um. Okay. Thank you. Um, well, um, my next question is. Um, how do you deal with pressure at work? Uh, you know, I don't deal too good with pressure. My last job, uh, it was so much going on one day and, you know, before I figured I'd curse somebody out or get into a fight, I thought it was just best that I just go home, you know, and start the next day with the, with the clean slate. You know, I just waited till, till clock out time because the last 15 minutes, 10 minutes, you know, I'm just looking to clock out. So I just figured I'd just wait till the next day, then come back. Because pressure, I don't think pressure is too good for nobody. Okay. All right. Well, I want to say thank you for so much for coming in today. Okay. And thank you for answering all my questions for this interview. Okay. Um, we will review at your application and also review this interview. And if we feel that you're a great fit for the position, we right. will definitely give you a call okay, and let cool. you know. Okay. okay. Well, thank you so much for coming in. You have a wonderful day. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Right. Hi, Mr. Thompson. Thank you so much for coming in today. It's hey, a pleasure to speak with you. And um, I will be, my name is Jessamine, and I will be conducting the interview. And we just have a few questions to ask you today. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Well, my first question is, can you tell me a little bit about yourself and why you want this job? Uh, I did some research on the company, and just by looking at the mission alone, it the values run right alongside with the the values that I have as far as myself. So the things that I took in consideration when I was looking at you as an option for my next employer, uh, it just the it just lined up. Everything lined up. So I, I really like the mission that you guys have. Okay, perfect. My next question is, how do you deal with pressure at work? Uh, you know what? Uh, I, what I would do is, depending on what type of issue it is, like the workload. As far as the workload, I pretty much just, if it's getting overwhelming, I take the time out to maybe stretch or... You know, um, grab a cup of water, but I definitely take the time out rather than letting it build up and then letting having it affect my work. So that's one way I deal with pressure. And uh, another one would be to just, you know, just take the time out to evaluate my my uh, the things on my agenda, and if I have to move some things around, that's definitely what I'll do. But I'll just to make sure the job gets done effectively, I pretty much take the time out to reevaluate things, stretch, grab a drink of water, something like that. 
Okay, perfect. All right, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, you've answered all our questions. We want to say thank you for taking the time out to come to this interview. We are going to evaluate the application as well as the interview questions. And if we feel that you are a good fit for the position, we will reach out to you and let you know what the next steps are. Okay. 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 All right. It's a pleasure speaking right. with you. Thank Have you. a great day. It was nice meeting you too. Thank you. All right. Bye. Goodbye. All right, everyone. So you guys just saw a little skit on do's and don'ts for interview questions. Right, right. And you saw that at the beginning, my husband was not wearing a tie. And then at the second scene, you no saw tie. him wearing a tie, mm -hmm. which is very professional for interviews. How did I do in the first without the tie? Um, horrible. One to ten. No mm -hmm. one. I would have gave it one and a half. <laughs> Yeah, so you don't want to go to an interview, and men, you have to wear a tie. If you're not going to wear a coat, just make sure you wear a tie. Mm -hmm. And women, make sure that, although you didn't see a woman in this perspective, but I'm just speaking from a general perspective, make sure that you have something that, you know, doesn't show off your cleavage. You want to dress right because your first impression is always a lasting impression. Right, right. And I'll say that. The tie was a dramatic difference. I could see it myself. It didn't have the relaxed look. It, it, it showed that you were more aware of your surroundings, aware of the opportunity, and it showed that you put some type of effort. So the tie was big. Yeah. The tie it was. and the attention to the, the questions yeah. and the, the preciseness with the answers. Yeah. So. So make sure that you have all your things lined up from the questions, from your wardrobe. Just make sure that everything is together. And I hope that we've helped you in somewhat ways to go into that interview and ace it. That's our objective. That's our point. That's our goal. We want to see you succeed. So hopefully this interview skit can actually help you in the long run. So again, please subscribe to my channel. Go on to my website, www.jezamine-hr.com to review, you know, tips on interviews and, you know, HR tips in general. All right. So, again, I hope to see you guys on the next, inter next YouTube video and you guys enjoy your day. All right. Cool. And leave comments and questions below. All right. See you guys next time.